Thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Julia Thatcher. Jeff Herndon has the evening off. Sedgwick County Fire now has a drone that can save lives. It can drop a life jacket to someone in the water. KSN's Craig Andrus got a look today as they tested it out in time for the holiday weekend. You know, they're putting this new drone through its paces today. While they hope they don't have to use it to save a life in the water, it could do just that. Sedgwick County Fire has been using a drone for some time to be the eyes in the sky, but not quite like this. Every minute counts when someone is drowning, and uh, this uh, drone is going to help us uh, give that victim a chance. Beyond the capability to bring someone a life jacket, the drone has infrared and thermal cameras and high-res video to do extended searches while keeping an eye on any emergency situation. We have a smaller drone with a smaller spotlight, and once you start using that spotlight, you obviously are going to drain the batteries pretty quick. Another upgrade, the batteries can be hot swapped on the fly, adding up to another 55 minutes of flight time. So we're going to do one battery at a time. We didn't have to turn the drone off. The county says the new ability to drop a life jacket could be a game changer, and this test a success. 10 4, he's on shore. Lieutenant David Griffith is getting a first look at the drone's water ops rescue. He's also excited for a long run time on this drone for extended grass fire calls. Um, they can get up over the scene and watch all the units and everything like that as they're doing things. Uh, and the command vehicle can stay put in one spot. The logistics of what a drone can do on a day-to-day -day basis make the difference between life and death. Something firefighters say is the reason why they do this job. I love it. Uh, making a difference in people's life is something that you truly cannot explain. You just have to do it. Firefighters tell me the entire setup costs around 30000 with about half of that going to the cost of those thermal cameras for extended searches when needed. Here for you, Craig Andrus, KSN News 3.